Okay, I'm ready to answer the questions. Number one, what time do you have dinner? Mm, as I have already said, uh, I come home quite late and that is why it's uh, too late to have dinner. So it can be just a quick snack, a yogurt or a cup of tea and a sandwich. Number two, how often do you watch TV? Maybe at weekends we can watch a film with my husband uh, and I always turn on TV when I do some housework but I don't watch it carefully. Number three, why do some people like to have a glass of wine at night? No. Maybe it helps to relax and to relieve uh, stress after a long working day. Number four, what do you do while running a bath? Mm, I hardly ever take a bath. I prefer to take a quick shower, so nothing special. Number five, how often do you take a bath? Mm, very rarely, uh, maybe once a month, when I, especially when I'm home alone and I can uh, run a bubble bath and uh, uh, just relax for a while. Number six, how often do you call a friend? I hardly ever call my friends. Uh, uh, sometimes we text to each other and exchange photos, but usually if I want to share the news and chat, I prefer to meet somewhere in a cafe uh, for lunch or dinner. Number seven. Who read to you before going to sleep as a child? Um, actually, I don't remember uh, that my parents uh, read me when I was a child. But when my daughter was uh, small, I used to read her books uh, uh, when I was putting her to sleep. Number eight. What is a good time to put a child to sleep? Mm, the earlier the better. Uh, if the child is small, I think 9 p.m. is okay. Uh, but speaking about my daughter, she stays up late and sometimes she goes to bed after midnight because uh, when it's uh, time to go to bed, uh, she realizes that she's not ready with her home assignment or she has to do something, so um, she goes to bed quite late. Number nine. Who do you say goodnight to? to my daughter and to my husband. Number 10. What time do you usually fall asleep? Mm, quite late. I'm not an early bird and I don't have any lessons early in the morning, so I don't need to set my alarm clock for uh, 6 or 7 in the morning. So that is why I usually stay up late. Sometimes I can uh, go to bed at 3 a.m. or 4 a.m. or I can read a book during the whole night. Uh, it's quite uh, common for me. Number 11. Why do you yawn when you see other people yawning? Mm, I don't know. It's funny when you start yawning, uh, when you see other people's yawning, but I uh, don't think that there is a connection. Number 12. Why do some people take sleeping pills? Because they can't fall asleep and they don't want to have a sleepless night. So they just, uh, some people like having a glass of wine uh, before going to bed. Some people take sleeping pills. It depends. Number 13. What days do you need to set the alarm clock for 7 a.m.? Uh, luckily, I don't need to set my alarm clock uh, for 7 a.m. Uh, my daughter starts uh, lessons quite early, but she uh, sets her alarm clock uh, herself and she wakes up, has dinner and goes to school by bus. And I can afford myself uh, to sleep uh, a little bit more. Number 14. What causes you to have a sleepless night? 
uh, what causes me to have a sleepless night. Sometimes I'm very excited about something that's going to happen and in this case I can find it difficult to fall asleep. Uh, sometimes I have so many ideas to think over and so many plans and it also can be the reason of a sleepless night. Number 15. Do you prefer to stay up late or go to bed early? Mm, I prefer to stay up late. Uh, I really enjoy the time when it's late and uh, when my daughter and my husband fall asleep and I can enjoy the silence and uh, uh, work at the computer, get ready for my lessons, uh, enjoy reading. It's just the perfect time for me. Number 16. Who do you know that tosses and turns all night long? Hmm, sometimes it's me. When I can't fall asleep, I always toss and turns and I sometimes uh, uh, get annoyed about it, uh, but I never take uh, sleeping pills. But sometimes I can uh, have a glass of wine before going to bed. Number one, what time do you... Oh, that's it.